Buddy, start of the game, Tyler Anderson, one, two, three, first inning, and after that, left a lot of pitches over the plate. What do you see out of him? And uh, you know, they, they found some, they, you know, a couple change-ups right, you know, by Nolan. You know, not, I mean, hit, I mean, hit okay, right? They were out in front of some change-ups. The, uh, the hit by Walker, he was out front, well-placed. Flores, same thing, out front, well-placed. You know, just, you know, by Nolan. Uh, the home run to uh, Marte looked like he missed his spot, right? I think he intended to go away. That looked as though it was middle in, maybe sort of down, but that's where he sort of likes it. Uh, the pitch to Jones, uh, you know, it was probably middle of the plate. I haven't seen it. Uh, Mark Tay got another base hit, then we took him out. But it was a little bit of, uh, you know, a little bit of a struggle for him, right? Just couldn't seem to establish anything. Uh, you know, couldn't seem to get any momentum. So, uh, you know, we have some things to work on. I have to follow up on that for the fourth inning. Was there thought of going, you had Shaw up. Yeah. Did you think about going to him, or was it, what, what went in the end? Yes, of that's, that's why we had Shaw. What went in the Anderson going back out from the uh, Well, it was the fourth inning, and I thought Andy could possibly throw two more innings based on what I saw his last six last six guys he faced. And there was a bunt situation there, first and second with one out. Uh, you go to the bench there, you have three three guys left. Uh, you know, you don't want to go there too early when maybe potentially the starter might go two more. So hoping that he would maybe get a bunt down, hoping Charlie would get a base hit, and then it would be six to four. With his situation, do you start to worry about the mental aspect of, of him starting to question himself? I mean, not so much with Andy. I think his, you know, one of his strengths is his, is his confidence and his, and his belief in his ability. I think it's more about, I think it's more about the, the physical and, and making pitches. We got to get to the point where, you know, he's keep consistently making pitches. That's where we got to get to. I don't think, uh, knowing Andy like I do, I don't think it's the, I don't think it will be a uh, a mental thing. Sometimes, just generally speaking, with a pitcher, like if a lot of different things are scattershot, not working, it can be hard to figure things out. Are you seeing consistent things that you know that he needs to improve on? And, and you know, beyond the obvious, but are there things that specifically you want him to be improving on? Well, I think with you know any starting starting pitcher, it, it comes down to the consistency of each pitch, right? Pitch to pitch. I mean, starting pitchers are asked to to throw 100 pitches, and, and Andy's style is such where he disrupts timing, and he has to, you know, get the ball in certain spots, uh, you know, throughout the course of his outing. And right now, there seems to be that, you know, the mistakes that he's making, the ball sort of elevated a little bit. Uh, the pitch efficiency is not there. There's, you know, too many deeper counts. I think there were, you know, the first four hitters. I think every, I think every count went to three, two. So, I think with with Andy, it's more about just stay hey, one good pitch after another. You know, you can't have one good pitch, one bad, one good, one bad. I think there's a little bit too much of that. On a brighter note, McMahon comes in, pinch hits, goes two for two. What does that kind of say about his maturity? Well, yeah, Mac, you know, Max, uh, Max hanging in there, right? It's a, you know, it's a, you know, every day for Mac, you know, as a full season big leaguer, it's a it's a learning experience. That was great to see. You know, he got a sinker down in his sort of wheelhouse down and in, and he, and he squared it up. And then, you know, another lefty. Uh, they put a lefty on him there in the in the ninth, and uh, you know, we got a base hit the other way, stayed on the ball the way. So that was a good sign. So, you know, all these are all these situations that we're putting back in are learning experiences, and he's been he's handling it so far. Thanks, buddy. Okay. Thank you.